Developing in Miami today, bombshell testimony in the trial of Joe Carollo. He's accused of abusing his power towards local businesses. Former police chiefs taking the stand with unflattering things to say about the city commissioner. Local 10's Ian Margle is live with it all. Ian. Yeah, and today her jurors heard from two former city of Miami police chiefs, one of whom was Art Acevedo, who had a lot of things to say. He called Joe Carollo Crazy Joe multiple times, said his disdain for these business owners is well known throughout the city. Meanwhile, defense attorneys for Carollo tried to paint Acevedo as a disgruntled former city employee. The federal civil trial for controversial city of Miami Commissioner Joe Carollo continues. The lawsuit at the center of the case, filed by Miami businessmen Bill Fuller and Martin Benilla, alleges Carollo repeatedly abused his power as a commissioner to target and harass them and their properties simply because they supported Carollo's political opponent. The suit describes police raids, repeated code inspections, and even late night visits from Carollo himself as he was looking for new violations. On the stand Tuesday were two former city of Miami police chiefs, George Kalina and Art Acevedo. You were not pleased with their uh, action, no, no, and now you want to no, act no, like no, we're in some, chief, on the no. Carollo court, no, and we're no. a defendant here, chief, and that doesn't please, fly with gentlemen. me. Colina testified about this encounter from February 2019, where the two got heated while talking about a particular unplanned visit to one of the businesses in question. I don't know who tells you what and what their motivation is and why. And then it was Acevedo's turn, and he pulled no punches, referring to Carollo as Crazy Joe at least three times and describing what he called the commissioner's obsession and disdain for Fuller as an open secret in the city. Carollo could only shake his head as he listened on, and his defense attorneys tried to discredit Acevedo, saying he has a personal vendetta against the city. And the final witness of the day was another former South Florida police chief, Richard Blom. He was the former Doral police chief. He was also the former chief of staff for Carollo. He called his time working for Carollo confusing, frustrating, and disturbing. And the only time he says he got wholehearted support from Carollo was when he was doing research about these businesses for the commissioner. This trial is expected to take two weeks. It will continue again tomorrow morning. Live in Miami, I'm Ian Margle, Local 10 News.